Alright guys, you saw, you saw the title and thumbnail of this video. In this video, I'm going to be making a World War II map and domination. If you enjoyed this video, please drop a like and sub as I would really help the channel a ton. And if you also really enjoyed this video, you can also drop a super thanks. And without further ado, let's honestly just get this. So basically guys, number one, if it's difficult to hear me because of the music or maybe I'm just not speaking that loud, I just turn on captions. And number two guys, now we're going to set the GDP domination of each country to 100% just to make sure that no one like accidentally wins. And we're going to start as the UN, aka none. And now guys, uh, let's just start off in Europe. But so now, guys, we're just going to click onto Germany, and uh, now we're just going to click Annex. Now, listen, guys, okay, we could do also military, although, honestly, I, honestly, this video is going to be kind of just annexation. And, uh, yeah, guys, I can need to raise the phone a little bit. Okay, and now I'm just going to annex Austria. Now I'm going to annex uh, part of Poland. Actually, maybe, like, 60% of it or something like that. So, yeah, we're going to annex a lot of it. By the way, guys, if you want to move around, uh, usually you should just click the pause button, it'll help a lot. Otherwise, it's going to, like, the game is going to keep recommending that you try to annex something else. So now, guys, I guess we'll also annex Kaliningrad. And we're going to annex another part of Poland, just a little more underneath Kaliningrad. Okay. And now, we're going to annex a small part of Lithuania. Really quickly. Okay, now I think Germany's done. So now, guys, we're going to swap to Poland. And what we're going to do with Poland is that we're actually just going to make Poland really quickly uh, annex a part of Lithuania and also the eastern part of, well, no, the western part of Ukraine and Belarus. So first, we're just going to make it annex a uh, part of Ukraine, but not too much, obviously, because, yeah, parts of it were controlled also by Romania and Czechoslovakia and obviously the Soviet Union. Yeah, that's a little bit of a problem. Okay, but we solved it. Now we're going to annex the eastern flank of Belarus, also. Okay, I mean, the border looks a little weird. Okay, but I guess uh, we'll also just annex a part of Lithuania. Uh, okay, maybe we should now just swap to Czechoslovakia. Don't worry, guys, we will deal with Poland at the end of the video. Trust me, I'll deal with it. And uh, now, guys, we're just going to make Czechia annex Slovakia and that part of Ukraine. I mean, it looks a little weird, but honestly, uh, yeah, if we could just get that small part given to Poland, I think that would look a lot better. Like, that part that kind of just looks like it shouldn't be there really quickly. Okay. Okay, cool. And now, guys, we're just going to rename the Czech Republic to Czechoslovakia really quickly. You just click the settings button, then you click the name. Now, really quickly. And now, uh, O, S, L, O. Okay. And now, guys, uh, yeah, I guess we'll just name Russia the USSR, and I guess we'll just make Russia annex really quickly. By the way, guys, uh, don't actually make Russia annex the Baltic states, it didn't control them in, because this map is supposed to be for 1938. So now guys, we're just going to make Russia annex Belarus. And, uh, well, not all of Ukraine, we'll get to Ukraine later, first we need to make Romania take some pieces. So yeah, we'll just make Russia annex the Caucasus really quickly. By the way guys, we need to just keep pausing and moving around. And then we're just going to make Russia annex Central Asia. By the way, guys, if you're wondering why I'm making this video, uh, yeah. After seeing how well the, like, uh, World War One video performed so far, I think you guys will be interested in this. So now, guys, uh, yeah, we're just going to make Romania annex a few parts of Ukraine. Like, for example, I think the Odessa region a little bit above Moldova. Oh, yeah, we just need to pause really quickly. And now we're just going to give Romania Odessa. Now we zoom out, and now we just need to take that small part north. Okay, I think it's good enough. Although the border does look a little weird, but we also need a small part of Bulgaria. Okay, and now we'll just zoom out. And... Okay, it looks good. Anyways, now I guess we'll just make Russia finally annex Ukraine, and then we'll probably just move on. Oh yeah, now guys, uh, yeah, we should probably just move on to Africa. 
now guys we're just going to make uh, the British Empire come back by clicking on the UK really quickly and we're just going to name it the British Empire uh, before we do some annexation really quickly okay now we click annex and now we're just going to make the UK annex a few colonies so uh, yeah it's going to take some time but overall it shouldn't take that long trust me it won't Okay, honestly, I don't really know what to say for this segment, I mean, like, we're kind of just giving the UK its colonies. And by the way, guys, I think it did control a part of Cameroon, so yeah, we're going to have to give it that. In a little bit of a divided way. And now, guys, um... Hmm, okay. I guess now we'll just zoom out again. And we might just give the UK maybe Tanzania. Okay, so we'll just give the UK Tanzania really quickly, and Zimbabwe, and by the way guys, in case there was a puppet state that the UK had, uh, we're just going to make it uh, annexed really quickly. So I guess, um, in case the UK controlled it, maybe we'll give it Mozambique. Okay, never mind. Uh, never mind guys, I think it didn't control Mozambique. Uh, we'll just give it uh, Sudan and South Sudan really quickly. Now, I know they were shared with Egypt, but uh, Egypt at the time was still somewhat ruled by the UK, so... Hmm... Anyways, okay, I guess just give it Mauritius, and what else? Be honest, guys, I'm, I'm kind of just looking at the map a lot, so I don't really have much time to talk. Uh... Oh, uh, yeah, let's just give the UK the entire Levant region. And also a few colonies in Arabia. And, um, I'm not really sure if we finished the British Empire yet, although it does have a, a few small holdings in China. Oh yeah, North Yemen was independent. Yeah, guys, uh, I almost forgot. I was just looking at the map. Anyways, um, now uh, we're just going to give the UK a few small holdings in Hong Kong and a little bit in China's Manchuria region. It's not very easy to make these holdings, like, exactly correct, but I'll try. Now, let's just give the UK Hong Kong. I mean, sorry guys if this map isn't exactly perfect, but, like, I'm kind of, at the moment, uh, looking at a map while I'm doing this, so, yeah, it's a little difficult to also commentate over this. And, okay. Oh yeah, by the way guys, uh, something that I want to talk about really quickly, like, uh, while I'm just making the British Empire. Um, I actually made a new poll, guys, and in this poll, you can literally ask me to uh, draw a nation with all, of its with all of its neighbors, and I'll kind of just publish it on the community tab, and then you guys can tell me what you think about it. And yes, guys, it will be like a sort of flag map, so yeah, I'm pretty sure you guys, uh, you guys would like it a lot, so yeah, um, you can vote right now. And uh, yeah, speaking of which, now we're almost done... And by the way, something I'm a little confused about is if we should uh, make uh, Canada annex into the UK. I'm not totally sure. But anyways, I mean, uh, next we can maybe do Japan. So, uh, yeah, let's just make Japan annex the Koreas. And we'll also give it Manchuria. I think it was a puppet state, but we'll still just give it by annexation. And... Hmm... We should also probably just give it to uh, Taiwan. And I think it also. Oh, yeah, also some islands. Sorry, guys, I'm really like. Uh, yeah, guys, it's a little difficult to kind of do this. And um, yeah, we might have given it a few islands of the US, although I think Japan controlled them at the time. And what the heck is happening? Okay, never mind, I fixed it. Okay. Okay. And I, I mean, yeah, guys, it's not really that easy to uh, map. 
with domination, I mean, it's not really that easy, but I mean, I can still try. And I guess we'll just uh, give Japan this. And we can also give the United States to the Philippines really quickly. So yeah, let's just do that. And I'm not sure if the US had any colony besides the Philippines. So now guys, uh, yeah, I guess we'll also just, um, yeah, I think that was it. Well then guys, I guess we'll just uh, swap to the Netherlands really quickly. And we'll give the Netherlands, uh, by the way guys, I should just uh, raise the phone really quickly. By the way guys, we're just going to give the Netherlands uh, Indonesia. And then we're probably going to do uh, probably the hardest task. Well, no, second hardest. Now we are going to make France. Yeah guys, the French Empire. So we're just going to name France to the French Empire really quickly. And now we're just going to swap to Annex. And now we're just going to give it its entire colonial empire in Africa. Honestly guys, to be honest, I don't really know what to talk about right now. Like, I'm kind of just making the map and I'm looking at the map and it's kind of difficult. By the way guys, uh, yeah, um, a little bit of a mistake that uh, you might, you may make is that uh, a lot of Morocco that's controlled um, by Morocco, uh, we should actually give to Spain really quickly. A little bit of the north and a little bit next to Western Sahara, so yeah, don't forget that. And I think there were a few nations in Africa that weren't colonized at the time. So yeah, we also uh, shouldn't forget those. So now let's just swap to Spain really quickly. Now let's just give Spain, I think, the north of Morocco. I think it controlled that at the time. And also that massive part of Morocco uh, as well, another part of it. That will just go right there. Oh yeah, also Western Sahara. So now uh, we'll just give it like that. Okay, that and until the border. Well, I mean, it's not an exact border match, but honestly, I think it's better than nothing. Okay, we just need to get rid of that one problem. Uh, almost there. Trust me, we will get there. We're very close. Okay. Oh. Hmm. Okay, it's gone. Okay, yeah, that's good. And now, guys, I guess just uh, maybe we'll leave Spain. I'm not really sure. Okay, so now guys, uh, we'll just swap to now, uh, probably maybe Italy. Yeah, we'll just give Italy its empire really quickly. But like, something important to note is that uh, I don't think Ethiopia was controlled at the time. It was controlled after during a war. So yeah, we're not going to make Italy directly annex Ethiopia yet. And uh, yeah, we'll just give France uh, Djibouti really quickly. I almost forgot. I may need a moment to look at the map, but honestly, I think I have it like almost exact. But I guess if I do make mistakes, which I've probably made multiple, please comment down below. Because yeah, I'm sure I've made multiple mistakes. But anyways, uh, yeah, I guess um, we'll just swap. Oh yeah, we almost forgot about Syria and Lebanon. We should give them to France really quickly. And we should also give uh, France a very small holding it had in China. And uh, yeah, we also shouldn't forget that Portugal also had a very small holding in China. And uh, wait guys, uh, wait guys, I actually need to look at the map really quickly because it's kind of difficult for me to memorize. So please give me a moment. Uh, let me just pause the video for a moment. All right, guys, I'm back. And uh, yeah, after taking a moment to look at the map, I actually changed a few things. And uh, yeah, let's just give Portugal its colonies really quickly. So uh, yeah, guys, number one, I actually renamed Yemen to North Yemen. And number two, guys, I just made sure, and I think that the DRC and Rwanda and uh, Burundi were also controlled by Belgium at the time. And as for Namibia, I think maybe it was controlled by the UK. Oh no, it was controlled by South Africa. And also Lesotho and Eswatini. And by the way, guys, we should also rename. Uh... Yeah, we should also rename South Africa. And now, guys, we should also rename the UK to the British Empire. 
And by the way, we really can't forget about that holding that Portugal had in China, which I know uh, is barely visible, but we're still gonna make it. Because yeah, we really need to add it. Trust me, it's very important. Anyways, uh, yeah guys, we're just gonna go right here. And we're just going to give Portugal a small piece of China really quickly. What? Okay. Well, yeah, guys, the whole thing is so small, the game struggled to even render it. Anyways, I guess we'll just click X and now click OK. Now we'll zoom out. And I think that Equatorial Guinea was controlled by Spain. I think it was. And by the way, we're gonna raise the phone. Uh, yeah, guys. Sorry, it's a little difficult to focus on everything. And uh, yeah, let's just swap the Spain really quickly. And we could rename Spain to the Spanish Empire, though it wasn't really the Spanish Empire at the time, so no, not really. And uh, now Equatorial Guinea. And now, guys, we're just going to give Belgium uh, the DRC and Rwanda and Burundi really quickly. And trust me, guys, I will eventually. Um, I'll try to fix the way that Poland looks. I know it looks a little weird. But trust me, I'll fix it. And if I can't fix it, um, remember guys, this isn't supposed to be exactly correct. So now guys, I guess we'll just swap to the UK and we'll just give it a few holdings that it has in the Americas really quickly. So yeah, let's just move up really quickly. And uh, yeah guys, I'm just going to bring uh, the phone a little closer to myself. And we're just going to give it Belize, and we're going to give it a few islands. Uh, yeah, this will take some time. But don't worry, it can't take that long. Don't worry. We'll, we'll, we'll reach the end eventually. Anyways, guys. Um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not really sure what to say, honestly. I think we really are near finishing. Well, I mean, we haven't finished yet exactly, but like, I think we're pretty close. Oh yeah, we should also, I think, uh, I'm not sure about this, but I think that Canada was a little bit divided. And I think the UK did have a part, like, directly uh, made a part of it. I think it was this part. So yeah, let's just give it to the UK. And wow, those are some pretty good looking borders. Now let's just click X. Oh yeah, I almost forgot, we should give Denmark uh, Greenland. Really quickly, like, I know even in Domination, it's independent, but, uh, just for historical sake, uh, no. Oh, yeah, maybe also Iceland also. Although I think Iceland was independent at the time. Yeah, I think it was independent. Anyways, um, yeah, I guess we'll also just make, uh, Yugoslavia really quickly. Really quickly, we're just going to make Yugoslavia, and, um, yeah, guys, I think we genuinely might be finished. Like, we either finished or we are really close, and remember this, guys, uh, uh, yeah, this map wasn't supposed to be made to be exactly correct, it was just supposed to be made to be, like, sort of correct, and by the way, guys, there was a small island that was controlled by Italy and Greece, so, yeah, we're just going to, uh, give that to Italy. And, um, what about Cyprus? I'm not sure if it was independent or was it controlled by the UK. I think it was controlled by the UK, so yeah. And also Northern Cyprus. And now, guys, I think we really, uh, I think we're now really close to being done. Like, like, actually, we are really close to being done. How could I forget about that? Come on. Let's just keep going. Uh, trust me, guys, we'll make it eventually. Uh, I just need to bring the phone a little closer to myself. Uh, yeah, guys, it's a little difficult to focus on everything. And now, guys, uh, wait, what? Okay. British Raj. Well, uh, no, guys, honestly, uh, I'd much rather just make it annexed into the UK. Uh, yeah, I'd much rather just make it annexed into the UK, so I. Wait, what the? What am I doing? What the? No, 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 no. let's just swap to the UK and let's just make it a direct annexation really quickly. And I think Myanmar was also a part of it. Yeah, it was. And now I think we're basically done. Well, almost done. Yeah, uh, the more I look at the map, guys, uh, yeah, the more I realize that I'm not done. Come on. Well, uh, yeah, I don't think there's anything left, really. And, I mean, did we finally finish? 
I think we did. Oh yeah, I almost forgot we need to get Finland uh, some parts of uh, Russia really quickly. And uh, sorry guys, but I really don't think I'm going to be able to fix Poland. Uh, yeah, I just don't know how to fix that. It looks way too weird. I'm, I'm sorry, but there's really not much I can do about it. And uh, Okay, we're definitely going to have to make that look a little bit better. Uh, please give me a moment to fix Finland really quickly because it looks kind of weird. Alright guys, I'm back. So I changed a lot of things. I think I sort of fixed Finland and I think I sort of fixed Poland. I mean, let me show you guys. Uh, let me just show you guys really quickly. Um, okay, I know it still looks pretty weird, but I think it's an improvement. And now guys, uh, let me show you something. I also renamed Thailand uh, really quickly. And I also renamed uh, China. Uh, and now guys, oh yeah, I also gave Ecuador a massive part of Peru, and let me just show you guys, yeah, there, and yeah, I think this might be the final map, although I'm not sure if Australia is independent, it's the big question, was it independent, I guess I'll just check after this video is done, since I kinda threw away the map like five minutes ago, and, uh, yeah, guys, I think this is kind of just the whole video. Uh, now, let me show you guys the final map by zooming out. Let me just show you guys real quickly. Uh, yeah. Honestly, I think the map looks amazing, if I'm being totally honest. But anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please drop a like and a sub. That would really help the channel a ton. Don't forget to comment down below, like, anything you may want me to do in Domination. Because, honestly, this is kind of just an experiment to see if you guys like this. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.